There is an irreconcilable identity crisis facing the young people of Trinidad and Tobago. That's the view of Attorney General Anand Ramlugam. Speaking at the Diwali Nagar last night, he explained government's role in bridging the burgeoning gender gap. It's not unusual these days to hear about girls outperforming boys at all levels in the classroom, in the workplace and even in the home. The shift presents a worrisome projection for many, including the Attorney General, outlines the breakdown. The boy of today is not being prepared for the girl of tomorrow. The girl of tomorrow is going in the direction of an educated, independent, classy and sexy woman. The boy of yesterday who is not being prepared for that girl of tomorrow is stuck in a time warp and caught in a phenomenal and endless cyclical identity crisis. And he says while a young man looks for a wife in the mold of his mother, possibly an extinct breed, for the opposite sex, it's the opposite. The daughter and the boy's sister in the very same home is looking for someone that is anything but like the father to marry. And this is why he says government continues its education thrust. Nursery to tertiary continues to be free with ever-expanding avenues. Government also recognizes the roles that religion and cultural traditions have to play in weaving a strong social fabric. It pumped $1.5 million, the largest sum ever, into this year's Diwali Nagar celebrations. And every place of worship gets $5,000.